you were to take a little trip in a time machine back over a hundred million years, the planet would be unrecognizable to you. But one creature that might make you feel a little bit more at home is the sea turtle. It has remained unchanged on this planet ever since. One species of ancient sea turtle around this time was over seven meters long. But right now on our Earth, the biggest species is the leatherback turtle, which is about the size of a small car. We now have only seven species of turtle on our planet, and all of them are currently endangered. Turtles play an important role in keeping the oceans healthy. They keep balancing food webs by eating jellyfish and grazing on sea grass beds. Their presence keeps coral reefs healthy and cycles nutrients through the sea and the land. And they do all this all over the world. They travel hundreds of miles between feeding grounds, breeding grounds and nesting grounds. How turtles navigate vast distances across the globe without a map or GPS has puzzled scientists for years. We now think that they have a type of internal compass that imprints the Earth's magnetic field onto them from the beach that they were born on. So even as baby hatchlings, they can stay on track for their very first migration in warm waters. Wherever you are right now, the Earth's magnetic field is going straight through your body. Scientists have discovered high concentrations of magnetite crystals in turtle skulls. As magnetite is magnetic, these crystals help turtles feel the magnetic field so they always know which direction they're going. We now think that salmon and even some types of bacteria can do this as well. That's totally awesome. Another theory is that turtles have special chemicals in their eyes called cryptochromes. They cause chemical reactions when they interact with the Earth's magnetic field and they effectively help the turtle to see which direction they should swim in. However they navigate, crossing hundreds of miles of ocean is hard work and turtles will eventually need a rest. But like us, they need to breathe air. So how do they go to sleep underwater? They can slow down their heart rate to as little as one beat every nine minutes and that reduces the amount of times they need to come up for a breath. Some turtles can hold their breath for up to five hours. This poses a big problem for all marine creatures, including turtles. Sometimes fishermen lose their nets at sea. Just because these nets don't belong to anyone doesn't mean they stop catching things. Known as ghost gear, turtles can easily get entangled in these discarded fishing nets, which can cause them to drown. As turtles mainly eat jellyfish, plastic bags floating about in the ocean often look really similar, meaning that turtles can easily end up swallowing large quantities of plastic. Climate change is also posing a big problem for turtles. Turtles lay their eggs on beaches around the world, but as our climate warms, the turtles' eggs get warmer too. Warmer temperatures mean that more baby turtles are born female. And whilst there are more for more women in marine biology, if we had too many females and not enough males, then turtles will find it harder to find a mate. Sea turtles have been evolving for over 200 million years, so we are nowhere near done studying the behaviour and the adaptations of these beautiful creatures, who play such a vital role in keeping our oceans healthy.